alligators are a common sight in Florida. This is the peak time for alligator activity right now. Regularly seen on highways, golf courses, even inside swimming pools. But after the tragic death of a two-year-old boy at a Disney World resort this week, many in the state are asking if they should be more concerned about these menacing-looking reptiles. With the millions of people that are in the state of Florida and the million alligators, the number of attacks is surprisingly low. According to the Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission, since 1948, the state has seen 257 attacks that require serious medical attention. Of these attacks, 23 people have died, including eight children. The likelihood of a resident being seriously injured in an attack, one in 2.4 million. Alligators are a defensive animal. They don't like being around people. They'll react with the stimulus, but they're not going to seek people out to try and eat them. It's just not in their nature. It's not what they do. Last year, Floridians experienced their first fatal alligator attack since 2007, when this 12-foot alligator killed a 61-year-old swimmer north of Orlando. I saw him floating around and thought he was diving. When I got there, he totally disappeared. A 22-year-old man also killed last year by this gator when fleeing a burglary. More recently, there have been multiple instances of alligators found eating human remains. Very amazing because I, I come in and out of here every day. I see a gator, I'm like, okay, it's a gator, it's the Everglades. And who could forget this viral video of a massive crocodile roaming across a Palmetto Springs golf course?